Well, after I got done watching Barney, I decided I wanted to play this really dumbass game. It's called Endless Online. Now, the first problem is typing in your goddamn password. You gotta go all over the damn screen, and your little buttons are flipping everywhere, and you have to try to get your damn password by typing in the different words. It's a pain in the ass. You, you just, it's just a pain in the ass. Only way. After you get done typing all that shit and you hit the login button, you get onto your naked ass character who's only wearing a dumb ass underwear, looks like a goofy motherfucker. You play him, wait about 10 hours for the screen to load up. I could dump my ass faster than that loads. Alright, so you walk around, basically you're this guy and you don't have a life, you just walk around different places. And the problem that pisses me off about this game is when you walk into somebody, you can't walk past them. You you have to just you run right into them. I mean, there's no way you can walk right past them. Talk about a pain in the ass. So you go into this little bank place. This is basically where all the other characters who are more experienced try to take advantage of the people who are stupid. And uh, you go in here and you click on the map just so you can figure out where the hell you are. But uh, look at that. The, the very helpful map. I mean, it's just absolutely great, especially for kids that are trying to figure out how the hell to play this dumbass game. And you can do all these weird symbols and shit, like they're supposed to mean anything to anybody. And, yeah, they got the worst clothing ever you can pick, you know, just some gay ass clothes that you can pick. Look at me, I'm so cool, I got glasses on. And a suit. Anyway, yeah, so you're walking around waiting for somebody to just take advantage of you. You put an expensive item on, someone's going to be like, Oh, I'll buy that for 1k, when it's worth like the most. And if you type in poop, the, the word poop is even blocked out if you believe that. And what pisses me off is, you can't even type right. You type on this game, you know what you're typing, and all of a sudden, it doesn't even space it out for you. you got to hit the space button like 10 times for it to actually space it out. It's just, it's just a bunch of bullshit. And watch this guy right here with the purple little sword thing coming up to me. He's trying to take advantage of my glasses because he knows that they're expensive. But what the hell? You can't. You mean you have to? You have to rearrange everything in your inventory to to put on a different pair of clothes. It just doesn't switch it automatically. Anyway, the, getting back to this guy. This guy's just waiting to take advantage of me because he knows I got something that's worth a lot of money. He thinks that uh, I'm stupid. So anyway, you're with this gay ass motherfucker and he's trying to take advantage of you. you put that on. And he's going to be like, oh, can I buy that for one gold when it's worth like a million? It's a bunch of horse shit. You go around, you can just piss people off all day. That's usually what I do. I mean, there's people around that are just constantly asking for money. They're paying the rat's ass. There's this guy here coming up to me. And I wouldn't give a rat's ass. And he just trades you anyway. He, he trades you anyway. You say, no, I don't want to trade you. They'll trade you anyway. You're playing, you keep in mind that you're playing with five-year-olds here. Just keep walking and walking. There's nothing, there's nothing really to do. Because when you click on that gay ass map, it doesn't even tell you where you need to go. See, look at this. How the hell are you supposed to know where you're going to go? This is a game for five year olds. And here, this guy's trading me anyway because he thinks I'm going to give him something. So I put that in. Those are pretty much worthless. He's trying to give me three of those. Anyway. Uh, and I keep trying to tell this guy I could give a rat's flying ass if it was talking to me, but he doesn't want it. He just wants to keep trading and trading, so. There's just nothing good about this game. You gotta be like three to play it. You don't even look at this map, just look at it. How are you supposed to have fun with that? What a load of shit. Anyway, you go back out into the little adventurous land, you walk back in, you go wherever the hell you want. Eventually, if you do too many things at once, uh, the game's just gonna freeze on you and it's gonna say that it's stopped and that it's not working and that's pretty much you have to restart everything all over again. Type in your password and people just... One thing I have a problem with people this game is they just follow you and they say you. You, you, you. Over and over again. I've never seen any other game where people just follow you and say you. I mean just say what you wanna say, damn it. You just sit in there all day long. You, you, you. Just say your damn thing you need to say. It's unbelievable. Really, this is one of the stupidest ass games in the whole world. <laughs> Unbelievable.